Hi, this is Richard Byrne at freetech4teachers.com. In the previous video, I showed you how you can set up your Feedly account and get started with adding some content to it. In this video, I'd like to share a little bit of my workflow in Feedly and how I use it in conjunction with Evernote to do some bookmarking and how I use it to uh, share some of my favorite resources. So let's say I'm cruising through my cultural and interesting category that I've made. And I'm scrolling along and I find something kind of interesting that I want to that I want to check out, like the Red Hot Chili Orchestra. So I can read it this way, it looks kind of interesting to me. And if I want to tweet it out, I'll just hit the tweet button here. And I'll quickly share it that way. Or if I want to look at it in its entirety on the web page, I'll click the title and it takes me here and I can scroll through and now if I want to save this to read later I use Evernote for my bookmarks and I'll just click the little Evernote button and I'll save my bookmark now you'll notice here that I also had the option to click Evernote here but if I click it here it's going to prompt me to upgrade to the pro version of Feedly, which is not something that I'm going to do. So my workaround again is to just click the title, go to the site itself, and then use the Evernote browser bookmark tool and bookmark it that way. So that's a little bit of my process of how to use Feedly to organize findings from my favorite blogs and websites. For more tips and tricks like that, Check out freetech4teachers.com.